In 1 Peter chapter 1 and verse 1, it reads, I'm reading from the New American Standard, Peter, an apostle of Jesus Christ, to those who reside as aliens, some versions translate that as strangers, scattered throughout Pontus, Galatia, Cappadocia, Asia, Bithynia, who are chosen. And here in this, I'd like to address this word aliens uh, or strangers. Obviously, we see who's, re who's writing the letter here. It's uh, Peter, the apostle, or one sent. Uh, what, that's what apostle means, one sent of Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ chose him and sent him as an apostle. But who is he writing to? He's writing to these strangers or these aliens. It's interesting that the Greek word here is only used three times in the New Testament. Here and also in 1 Peter 2 and verse 11 when he says, Beloved, I urge you as aliens and strangers to abstain from fleshly lusts, which wage war against the soul. The other occurrence is in Hebrews chapter 11 verse 13 where he says, all these died in faith without receiving the promises, but having seen them and having welcomed them from a distance and having confessed that they were strangers and exiles on the earth. He's talking about the heroes of faith who saw themselves as being strangers and exiles on the earth. So it's interesting that he's writing to Christians who should view themselves spiritually as exiles, as strangers. But also, most likely, these uh, could have been Jews who were converted on the day of Pentecost. Many of the nations that are mentioned here in the first couple of verses are also mentioned in Acts 2 and verse 9 and following with the, those who were gathered at Pente for the Pentecost feast that heard the first gospel sermon and the apostles speaking in tongues, the gospel message. Hope this was helpful.